news emerged that Guarani Elbit's APC deal in the Philippines was experiencing difficulties. Whether the APC Guarani project will be stopped from being sent to the Philippines, considering that the Philippine Army successfully acquired 28 units of APC Guarani and they will be sent in stages. Considering that the Philippines previously failed to take possession of 22 Koryong MLRS from South Korea, the pattern of the Guarani APC project is more or less the same as the Koryong experiencing delivery delays. It turns out that Germany vetoed the export of Guarani APCs from Brazil to the Philippine Army. The execution of the deal to supply the Philippine Army with APCs encountered difficulties and was actually halted. The Philippine website Max Defense discusses reports coming from Brazil about a veto imposed by Germany on the supply of Guarani 6x6 APCs from Brazil to the Philippine Army. It is believed that the veto is Germany's response to Brazil's refusal to supply 35mm ammunition to Ukraine for the Jeopard air defense system that Germany provided to the Ukrainians. The future of this deal therefore depends on the current relationship between Germany and Brazil, given US President Joe Biden's conversation with Brazilian President Lula da Silva about the situation in Ukraine. The recent UN vote condemning Russia for its invasion of Ukraine will lead Brazil to start producing 35mm ammunition for the air defense system held by Ukraine. The website says that Israeli Elbit Systems, being the main contractor of the Philippine Army's wheeled APC acquisition project, will be in charge of talking to the Philippine side and mentions that Elbit chose the Guarani chassis manufactured in Brazil by Iveco over the Pander 26x6 APC chassis in order to create commonality with the Pander 28x8 vehicle that will serve as the basis for the light tanks that the Philippine Army should receive soon from Elbit. Elbit's decision to give up the Guarani chassis will result in another postponement of the entire project by one to two years, according to the site. No response to this item was received from Elbit Systems. Philippine Army's Armor Division Commander Major General Facundo Palafox IV mentioned in a media interview lately that they will be receiving 28 6x6 wheeled armored personnel carriers armed with 25mm cannons by 2024. He was referring to the VBTP Mr. Gorani 6x6 wheeled APCs being supplied by Israel's Elbit Systems in cooperation with Italian Brazilian. Venture I Vico Latam under the PA wheeled APC acquisition project. Previously Max Defense PH has reported that the APCs will be coming with only 12.7mm heavy machine gun mounts and not medium caliber guns like 25mm cannons. So we welcome the update from MGen. Palafox. But we have some reservations on this as our previous info came from the terms of reference of the project, which is part of the project's contract. The only possibilities we see on the upgrade of weapons from 12.7mm heavy MGs to 25mm cannons could be due to a variation order from the DND and Philippine Army. Or if Elbit Systems is upgrading its offer on its goodwill, especially with the project now delayed. Due to Germany's decision to hold the deliveries of the vehicles due to Brazil's political issues with Germany. So far, the latest photo we got and shared by one of our community members from the recently concluded LAAD Defense and Security Expo 2023, of what appears to be one of the Philippines-bound Guarani 6x6 APCs has a 12.7mm heavy machine gun mount on an Ares Reman manned protected turret, which supports the earlier information we have. FYI, Ares is the Brazilian subsidiary of Elbit Systems again. This can be subject to changes so we are also hoping that a 25mm cannon will be used on the Philippine Guaranis instead. 
The Gorani 6x6 wheeled APCs are being procured under the Wheeled Armored Personnel Carrier Acquisition Project of the Philippine Army. A Horizon 2 phase priority project under the revised AFP modernization program. The five vehicles are expected to be delivered to the Philippines soon. It remains to be seen if the integration of Elbit supplied systems will be made in the Philippines. The Philippine Army expected the delivery of 28 such vehicles, acquired under the Wheeled Armored Personnel Acquisition Project.